Choppers. Gotta prop this guy up all sketchy. Looks good to me. Welcome back to the middle of the day. High UV, windy, shark infested water channel. Just over here casting in the surf for a bit. Catching some schoolies. See what happens. There we go. Hopefully I'm not cursed for the day. Hey buddy. A little striper on the epoxy jig. So I'm just using the hoagie epoxy jig again. The single hook on it. It's a two watt single hook. And mainly because there's lots of little blue fish around. I don't want to lose any soft plastics. Something. I think this might be another striper. Well, bigger than the one before. It's a decent fish. Hey, buddy. Just going to get a quick picture with you, bud. I'll get you on your way. I already got the other camera rolling. Don't worry. Nice fish. All right, buddy. See you later. It's 1.30 in the afternoon. You'd think you wouldn't be catching stripers, but hey, why not? Found a nice little area to land these guys. Hey, bud. They're just like chilling right next to the rocks. It's like a ton of them in there for some reason. Easy with that single hook to pop right out. But yeah, there are these little, little stripers just hanging over there. A lot of them. All right, buddy, I'll see you later. Ugh. Oh, oh, oh! I think there's a bunch of bluefish in here. That guy followed it all the way up. <laughs> all right, line breaker. Line breaker, chaotic man. Oh, I see you. Don't want you to bite my line. There we go. Got control of the beast. I'm telling you, everything likes the epoxy jig. Something about the epoxy jig right now that everything is, is liking it. Look at this beast. I wonder if any of these guys want them. Oh man, they are loaded in there. Oh, there we go. He grabbed it that time. Damn, there's a bunch in here. Whoa. I think they're just fired up. There's a bunch in there. It's like connecting immediately. This guy's much bigger. This one's pretty nice. Oh, 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 perfect, nice. The water's really high right now, so that's an ideal release right there. I'm in a great predicament right now where if I cast to my left on the ocean side, it's all stripers. And if I cast to my right on the inlet side, it's all bluefish. Probably Spanish Max mixed in. But today's a good day. Uh, oh, no, no, don't take my epoxy, no! Fish are going absolutely goombas for these epoxy jigs. I don't mind it. You know, you get broke off less. I think we're going to switch back to the striper side in a second. There appears to be a lot of blues over here. Things are everywhere. Choppers.
Man, if this is how the midday bite is, I don't even want to know what sunset's going to be like. It's going to be hot potatoes out here. Oh, he hit that last minute. I've been wanting to try this dark sleeper lure for a while. See if this works in salt water. This is three quarter ounce in pink. Ah, I think I got to keep getting bluefish. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dark sleeper keeps grabbing the blues. Oh, and there goes the dark sleeper. If you ever want to get a good bicep workout, just come to the jetty and catch sea robins. Hey, buddy. I'd rather stay on this side and catch the striper than the bluefish, to be honest. These guys are a blast to catch. A lot of spikes, though. Got to be careful. Oh, man. Followed that one. All right. Low tide. There we go. Oh, there he is. Nice. Sweet. Hey, Phil. Phil on the Mackinac. Saying hello to Phil. All right, Phil, I'll see you later. Phil's always in the shadows. Shadows. Phil's always in the shallows right now. Can't get away from these guys. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> no, that's a good that's eater right there. These are the size you usually catch on. Some of them come in this size. Like this. And bigger. Damn! Well, that's a, a lot of meat. Them. You can take a few pictures of them. Say hello here. These are the size, man, you catch out there. So it's worth the walk. You know what I mean? And Shout look. out to Johnny and Brian. Yeah. I don't know, y'all. Might just be a bass and blue kind of day. Oh, he got one fluke. It's not bad. Something really big out in the surf. Keeps, like, jumping out of the water. I can't believe there's a marlin out here. It's so wild. I thought that I saw one a couple weeks ago, but I don't know, you never know. It's getting wild out here. People are getting bit by sharks and stuff on the beach. Getting crazy. All right, well, I'm probably just gonna keep fishing into the sunset. If I don't get anything, I'm gonna hit up the Mr. Softy truck, pay my friend a visit, and enjoy the rest of the evening. You all take care and I'll catch you soon.